Thanks Schick Intuition for sponsoring this video. Okay, so I usually just use an app to meditate or I'll do like a playlist on YouTube or something. And then if I need a little back support, I'll take a pillow and just really get comfortable here. Since I only put oats and water in here, I'm going to put some vanilla extract to give it some, you know, some flavor. And I used to put sugar or like honey in this, but I'm trying to cut down on my sugar intake, you know what I'm saying? So now I only put vanilla extract in. It gives it enough flavor to where I don't need to put sugar in it. Okay, so usually I would put like fresh fruit in here, like strawberries and blueberries, but I ate them all already, so this will just have to do. <laughs> I just took a shower. Um, I didn't wash my hair because I only wash my hair on days where I do cardio for exercise. And since I just did like yoga, which is very low impact, um, I didn't wash my hair. I just put it into like this little sleek bun so that it's out of my face. And then after I take a shower, I really like to put my jewelry on because I don't know, it makes like body care and skin care more fun. Like you feel more elegant, you know what I'm saying? So I put my jewelry on. <laughs> now again, this video is sponsored by Chic Intuition. Um, usually I would do this step while I'm in the shower. Like I would do this while I'm taking a shower, but for the sake of this video, I'm just gonna do it after I take a shower. So this is the Chic Intuition razor. Um, it has like this really nice moisturizing bar right here by the razor. Um, they sent me two of these, so I opened up a new one so you can see what the moisturizing bar looks like. Uh, it comes in three different... I almost said flavors. <laughs> Types? Fragrances? Um, they have Sensitive, Island Berry, and Pure Nourishment, and this one is the Sensitive one. This one has Aloe Vera and Vitamin E, which is really cool. Now, what I like about this is this moisturizing bar, when you use it in the shower and when there's, you know, water 
added to the equation, um, it starts to lather up a little bit. And while you're shaving your legs, so while this razor is removing hair, the moisturizing bar is moisturizing and softening your skin. So because of that, you don't really need to use a shaving cream which is fantastic. I kind of hate using shaving cream sometimes because number one, it's an extra step, and number two, it gets really messy sometimes, especially if you use like a, like a shaving cream, like the moussey kind of, it just gets all over the bathtub and it just creates a huge mess. So what I like about this is that there's no hassle with using an extra product or an extra step. All you literally need is this one razor. You don't need to buy like a separate um, shaving gel because of this moisturizing bar. So I'm gonna show you how to use this real quick. But again, as I said, I usually do this while I'm taking a shower. <laughs> okay, so first of all, um, you can exfoliate before or after you shave. It really all depends on what you want to do. Um, I have this exfoliating towelette that I use every time I take a shower and I just lightly, you know, go over it with some body wash, you know what I'm saying? And I like doing that to loosen dead skin cells so that I get um, a clean, like, soft shave, you know what I'm saying? Okay. So, let's get started! So, as you can see, that moisturizing bar is putting in some work. Moisturizing and softening that skin. There is no need for shaving cream. We love to see it. Don't mind this. I went and sat at a park and I think I got like attacked by a bunch of mosquitoes because I have a bunch of bites all over my legs. My favorite part about shaving my legs is at night when you hop into like clean bed sheets with freshly shaved legs. Ooh, girl! That's it. So my legs are freshly shaven and they're also moisturized. Look at that. That moisturizing bar just softens and hydrates and moisturizes the skin. Look at that. Ooh! That moisture! Yes! Let's do this morning skincare, girlies! After I wash my face, I only pat dry my eyes and my mouth and I leave the rest of my face a little damp because now I'm going to use an essence and this has hyaluronic acid in it so I want to apply this to damp skin for ultimate hydration. My shoulders as long as I'm able Let's get the monster Sunday open Deep in the And then I'm going to take a hydrating toner Usually I would do a hydrating toner before I apply that essence But because this toner has oil in it I'm going to apply this after the essence Ooh, look at the hydration Okay, now I'm going to apply my daily moisturizer And then, we cannot forget SPF. Honestly, this is a look. This is kind of cute. But no matter what comes your way, I will stay right here. Mm. All right, now it's time to get dressed. And I just got these two new pieces in the mail, so um, I mean, this is the, like the perfect chill outfit. Um, this denim's really soft, so it's gonna be comfortable. And they're like loose fit, so it'll still be comfortable at home. And I'll feel a little bit more put together, so I'm gonna put this on right now, and we'll get started with our day. Outfit of the day! Just a super comfortable, casual outfit today. And then I also put my necklaces on because 
you know, this basic white tee was a little too basic, so I needed to step it up, you know what I'm saying? Um, and now I'm just going to do a light um, makeup look. I already have a video of like my everyday makeup. If you wanna check that out, I'll leave a link right up here and in the description box down below. But I'm just gonna do a lighter version of that. Like I don't think I'm gonna do a, a winged liner today. I think I'm just gonna keep it super natural today. And again, I just wanna show you like how important wearing jewelry is to me when I'm getting ready. Like even the way I hold my brush is different. Like I just did my nails two days ago and I'm wearing my rings, like it just, application is it just feels different you know it's a different experience and then i'm going to use an under eye concealer that is the same color as my face i don't want to brighten it i just want it to be the same color as the rest of my face yes Okay, so I don't really like checking my phone first thing in the morning. I like to do all of my self-care stuff first before I check emails, open Twitter, read the news, especially with the current state that the world is in right now. I don't really like using all of my energy that I've woken up with and putting that into that, into consuming information immediately after waking up. I like to use my energy to take care of myself first and then I can take care of other things after I've taken care of myself. So um, at this point, um, you know, I'll start checking my emails, I'll start, uh, you know, scrolling through Twitter, going through um, Instagram, reposting your guys' stories if you mention me and them and you know, things like that. But I also really like to do um, other stuff on my phone that doesn't have to do with social media. <laughs> like I like to use apps to learn languages. I'm trying to learn Spanish right now. Um, I tried to learn Spanish and Korean at the same time and Korean is a really tough language. I really love their writing system. I think their writing system is genius. Mwah but like the pronunciation and like uh, the speaking of it is really tough. So I'm focusing on Spanish now, for now. <laughs> and then I also like using apps to like play brain games and things like that. In the past I've done like really intense morning routines, but I found that um, I don't like starting my day with doing trying to complete so many tasks because by the time I finish my morning routine, I'm like, mentally exhausted because you know i've been checking off a checklist just for my morning routine so i like to keep it pretty simple thank you guys so much for watching this video thank you Shik intuition for sponsoring this video and i'll catch you guys next time